Yep. So this has been the little project of the day. Doing my benchings. Now, you know, I've had these for a while. Um, I just left them in the garden. You know, it's all I use to clean them. It's the Brillo pad. Not wet. So just, it's the rub. So the next move, no, just give me pints. I've got to order the bolts, nuts and bolts. I've got the wood already, so I'll get that stained over the next few days. I'll show you. Still parts I've still got to get, obviously, but they look quite good. I'm going to make it into a, this was a chair, but I'm going to make it into a bench and hopefully be able to leave it out the front somehow, out the f dirty scummy scrap men nicking it. I'm not saying all scrap men are scumbags, but one of them, or oh, somebody, nicked my grandson's bloody bike the other day. He's three years old, man. And you know what he done when he knew? Cried. What would it have been worth to them? Ten pound? If they sold it? Ten pounds? Shipping neck, man. Yeah, so, this is where we're at. This is the new project. Now, I've had a bit of help today. Bartley's been helping me. Hey, you might. Hey, and Puppy's been helping me as well. Oh hey, yes, yeah, been keeping me company in this lockdown situation. Hey, yep. My son was going to help me, and then he decided to mess around with his nitro car. And now, he's gone round the shop and said, do you know what, I'm going to get a barbecue. He's gone, we're having a barbie on the front. <laughs> so funny. See if he can get coal. I've got a little bit of coal, so I'm still going to have a barbie either way. Mm. Do you think I need to do the garden again? think so. Yeah, so. Days anyway. Oh, where I was at. <laughs> what I'm going to do. So I'm going to do black. I'm going to do these gold. And this one. I don't know why. I just see how it looks. If it don't look right at all. Repaint it, won't I? Then I'm going to have to get some threaded bar. I'll probably get that from Grape Bar or Perry Bar. Mm, don't know. We'll see. Right, back on the next bit of it. Yeah, so it went from um, bench ends, yeah, to. Having a bar, but <laughs> couldn't help it. Yeah, I know I got distracted hard, didn't it? Doesn't matter. Mm. And then burgers are bangers, let me tell you. And I know they are, because I didn't make them. Mm. So, here's my progress so far. Yep. I've got that. That. Now, what I've done is I tried this paint. You know what? See this? 
Oh, I'll use it. High performance, you know. Best value. Oh, yeah, fucking water, you bastards. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to swear. So I thought, I, I put a little bit on the one leg. It just, no, it was crap. So I went for this. I think it went on quite nice. But you know what? I only had one tin. One tin. Right, same thing, pound shop. Look, that's all it done, you know. That's not done on the other side, let me just say. That's just one side. Well, one and a half. Done my head in. Just let me just say. I'm not running the pound shop. So now, I'm going to try a bit of this. I'm going to try a bit of the paint here now. If it matches, looks like I'm painting, doesn't it? Let's take about 10 coats. That spray, if I'd have had a couple of cans, would have took me. I think, I think it would have one coated. Yeah, so, a bit of a wounder, but it is what it is. Back on the paintbrush. <laughs> oh, it'll look nice, won't it? I paid nothing for it. I've got some wood off my old fence that I built years ago, which I got that wood for nothing. Respect Mark Green. Um, should be all good. I love it. The only thing that's going to cost me money here is I've got to buy a bar for the bottom support. And the nuts and bolts. Because I have to chop them off. Rusty as hell. I weren't messing around with them. They're old, they're done. So I just bolt cropped them. That's the easiest way. Right, on the paintbrush I go. So here's the bad bit. You can't really spot where the paints would spray. But I've noticed that some of the paint needs a second coat. I don't know if you can see some of this. I can see the green through it. The paint's very thin though. I'll tell you what though, I ain't moaning. I think it looks quite Good man. That's pound shop paint. I only use the best. Don't know whether to touch it. Oh, let's have a go. Wow, it's dry. Oh no, it's a bit tacky there. I've done this one second. No, I'm gonna have to leave that for a bit. <sighs> Tell you what, that might line it up so I can start painting the other side. I'm gonna give this a lick. I'll do these bits. I'm doing gold. Hmm. It might look rubbish, but you don't try, you don't know. Right. I'll leave that to dry for another hour then. See if I can get these lifted up or something. Oh yeah, we got silly ladybird doing over the bloody wet paint. Or as would say when I'm in America, ladybug. Hmm.
A little bit of patching up, it's not too bad. So, give it an hour and a half, don't know. Because it's still tacker. Oh no, that's, that's wicked. I say some places of, you know, I'm going to have to second coat it, look, but. Right, man, oh, it's, yeah, it is a bit tacky in places, but. I think it's going on quite well. Oh, that's tacky under that. That one in. Now for the next sort. Yep. See if there's any way I can lift this. Oh, so it's still tacker. Now I'm gonna leave it. I'll do the other side a bit later. Yeah, just leave it to it. So yeah, I'm back on it. Do the other side. Well, that's the old well, with that paint. It's not that bad, look. Yeah, I got my slippers on again. They don't look that bad, for truth. So I'm going to let that dry. Um, and if it comes to it, I think I'm going to go and buy some spray cans to matter. But in the meantime, I see there's still some bits of green, man. That upper. I've got some of this wood. Now look, I know it don't look the best. But with a quick sand, comes up lighter. It's not bad. I'll get my sandpaper. I can round them. What do you reckon? Am I going too wide with the wood? You'll see. But as I said, I'll we'll try and do this for as little expense as possible. And because the wood's filthy like that, I'm going to give it a sand. But if it don't come up clean enough, I'm going to stain it. If it comes up nice and clean, I'll varnish it. Which I'd rather varnish. I love varnish. So that's where I'm at. Let me tell you, painting them. Bleeding, have a per one. Solid, one solid. That paint's that bad. I don't know, maybe I should have bought an undercoat. That'd have been three freaking coats, wouldn't it? No, I ain't playing that. Need to get some spray cans to matter. I'm going to get on this wood. I'll be back in a minute. Back on the bed and chins. As you can see, I can still see a bit of green in them, so I've got another can of spray. I've got more than one, so I should be able to finish them this time. So yeah, hose it goes off on the other side, and I get it. It's 
So what I'm doing now, you can see there's the turned out all right, man. So I've got a little piece of wood, and I'm going to try and mark the big piece of wood with this, you know, so I can drill it. So I've got my little sharpie. I've already done it, so. I just mark my dust off, you know. You know. So now, hopefully, when I put the piece to this, it's going to go straight on. I should hold my bench, then I'll do the top one. <clears throat> hopefully, I can do the top one then. And that should hold it all together so I can fit and mark the rest of the pieces of wood. Hmm, we'll see. Why well, does it sound easy and I know it's not going to be? Well, we won't know until we try. So, Tell you what, they're heavy, you know. So, so now if I put that right on that, now a lie. I'm going to go to the other side. Now, if I drill through that, that hole should be right. Sure, I'm at. As long as I get this straight, one way to find out, isn't there? Right, let me get me drilling everything, and here we go. Let's have a look. So yeah, let's have a go. I need to put a piece of wood underneath, really, don't I? Scrappy. <coughs> now this, if I can get this straight, should fit straight to the bench. the bolts fit straight through. No, of course they don't. Why would they? That'd be way too easy for me. I tell you what, there's a lot of brands that train there today. Right, another roll. Bit bigger. fit for a, just an hammer just had someone walk past them must have thought you nutter you're talking to yourself um let's go and find an hammer see ya the other side of the piece of wood one fitted in lovely. So I can just drill this one right. I'll hold the bottom of the bench. Gonna be a lot of sand in this in it. Oh well. Products. 
I'm buying. Oh shit. Yep. I'll tidy all this crap up anyway. Right, now let's see if it fits on. Give it two minutes. Yeah, so what I've done, I've bolted this bit in. Yeah, I bolted this bit in, not full out. I know they're rusty, but I'm going to order new ones. I'm going to try and get the other end in. See if we can do that. People are walking past, catching me speaking to myself. <laughs> oh well. So what we ended up with Another set of benches. These were this was an old bench I had and I think this is gonna look lovely. I don't even need to paint this one. Just to clean up in it. People think I'm talking to myself here, you know. Proper. So this side of the bench is going to look, but I've got to clean this up. And I'll show you in a day or two when I've cleaned it all. Let's see if I can find this paint for these. Garden's coming. Mm. Yeah, I forgot to say, look. This is going to be part one of the video. We get all this wood sanded. And I'll come back when I'm going to put all the I'm going to bolt all this. I'll get the bolt holes first, then I'll varnish it all. It's you know, should look cool. Well, I hope it does. I hope it don't go crooked. <laughs> That'd be fun, huh? So, yep, we're on it. <laughs> 